Welcome back to Spiritually Speaking Podcast Show. Today, I'm going to tell you about the 10 best types of crystals and gemstones that you can give your loved ones, friends, or family this year for Christmas. So stay tuned. I'll be right back. Welcome to Spiritually Speaking Podcast. My goal is to teach you the elements of spirituality that will show you how to find your passion and purpose in life. I'm your host, Lisa Maria. So join me in another session of Spiritually Speaking. Welcome back. Welcome back, everybody. You know, there's nothing like receiving something so pure and genuine from a friend or family member, such as healing gemstones and crystals. Crystals and gemstones are not just things. They are lifelong friends that come from someone that loves and cares for you. So in return, they hold that intention and that healing energy. Crystals are like time machines. They hold all of your energy from wherever it has been, including through the hands of those you have purchased it from. So it's important to cleanse your crystals, either through white sage smoke or place them in the sun or moonlight for at least 24 hours. Before giving crystals and gemstones to friends or family, And after cleansing the energy from them that was previously put into them, be sure to place your intention into them and fill them with positive healing energy for the person that you're giving them to as a gift. I'm going to go through some great crystals and gemstones to give as the best gifts for Christmas this year. So grab your pen and paper because you might just hear one that just kind of attracts you because crystals attract us just as much as we are attracted to them. Rose Quartz. Rose Quartz is a loving friendship crystal that delivers healing energy to the heart chakra. It's purifying and clarifying energy that relaxes the vibrations to the aura. This amazing and beautiful healing crystal helps to open the lines of communication So instead of walking into a conversation ready for confrontation, you'll be ready for reconciliation. Rose Quartz is known as the Love Stone and is the stone of universal love. Rose Quartz opens the heart to love and gives inner peace, helping in all matters pertaining to love in every possible form. Give Rose Quartz Crystal as a gift when you want to bring you and your friends back to a place of love. Selenite Desert Rose Selenite Desert Rose are said to contain a spirit guide and each one is different. Because of this, they're useful as protective talismans and can increase your own self-confidence and self-worth. Selenite Desert Rose, Crystals and Stones, can increase creativity as well as psychic abilities. And if you suffer from phobias, especially claustrophobia, keep a Desert Rose handy for its calming effects. You can give Selenite Desert Rose to a friend or a family member as a gift. When they're dealing with grief or want to let go of those things or emotions that have been keeping them from living their highest purpose. Amethyst. Amethyst is a very powerful and protective crystal and is a first choice of many metaphysical healers. Amethyst was used in ancient times to recover from both physical addictions as well as addictive relationships and became known as the stone of sobriety. A natural stress reliever, amethyst can encourage inner strength. The strong healing energy of amethyst can transmute lower vibrations to higher frequencies, transforming negative energy into loving energy. Amethyst clears and repairs holes in the aura and draws in divine energy, as well as aligning and fostering 
cooperation between the energetic bodies. Amethyst connects the physical plane with higher realm, making it a good choice when working with the third eye chakra. Amethyst also provides a wonderful, peaceful energy for meditations and helps with developing intuition and psychic abilities. It also opens and activates the crown chakra as well, allowing easier access to the divine. So you can give amethyst to anyone for, as a gift for the holidays when they want to enhance their spiritual awareness, spiritual wisdom, or promote a higher state of consciousness. Fuchsite. Fuchsite crystals are sometimes called the stone of health, in part because it can help access information on health from the higher realms. Fuchsite can also help one bounce back after emotional or physical problems. It can also help get information on daily routines, stress, pets, and careers. Fuchsite can bring friendliness, compassion, and lightheartedness. It's said to speed deep healing by assisting with recovery and immunity. It also increases energy transfer when multiple stones are used for healing altogether. So give a few shite crystal as a gift when a friend or family member is healing from emotional or physical health issues. Rodenite. Rodenite helps to balance the emotions and calm impatience. Rodenite is a very supportive stone that works with the heart chakra to attract love and ground negative energy. Like rhodocrosite, rodenite is often used for rediscovering one's inner gifts as well as for bringing much needed love into the world. Rodenite can also help one to remember their sole purpose of incarnation and facilitate living from the heart. This lovely stone also helps one to remember that the best rewards come from serving the highest good. Rodenite can assist one in discovering one's true passion and learning brand new skills too, if necessary, to enhance that passion. Rodenite encourages people to find ways to be of service to humanity and helps to draw in synchronization related to that goal. You can give Rodenite as a Christmas gift this year. If you want to help your friends or family see areas in their life that can be improved without getting down on themselves or criticizing or judging themselves. Black tourmaline. Black tourmaline is a protective stone which repels and blocks negative energies and psychic attacks. Black tourmaline also aids in the removal of negative energies within a person or a space. Black tourmaline will cleanse, purify, and transform dense energy into a lighter vibration. Black tourmaline is also great for grounding. It balances, harmonizes, and protects all of the seven chakras, plus the others that are not so well known. Use black tourmaline to protect against electromagnetic smog, such as cell phones and computers, or radiation, noise sensitivity, and other such disturbances. Black tourmaline can be used as an aid to remove fear and boost self-confidence. It also has a calming effect when needed, grounding flighty or scattered energies into the earth. You can give black tourmaline as a Christmas gift to those who face challenges from negativity, frequent worrying, or even obsessive compulsive disorder or OCD to help heal the root of the issue that causes these specific ailments. Blue satellite. Working within the third eye, blue satellite has a strong ability to accelerate the development of psychic gifts. They can stimulate the birth of clairvoyant abilities or strengthen them if you already are using these gifts. 
Blue satellite has a vibration that aids truth and helps you to better understand the life you are living and how you came to be in the situation in which you find yourself. Many people find it easier to avoid the truth as it can sometimes be uncomfortable. Blue satellite aids idealism and self-discipline and the combination will benefit you to enhance your ability to live a more authentic life. You can give Blue Satellite as a gift to a friend or a family member that's looking to end a relationship or situation in their life that no longer serves the highest good of all. Green Quartz Green Quartz has a healing effect on the heart chakra when worn or carried. Green quartz can help transmute negative energy into positive energy. Green quartz is also known to attract prosperity and success and to stimulate one's creativity. And carrying a green quartz will help to activate the heart chakra, creating a sense of wholeness to the owner. Green quartz can help one to learn empathy in a dog-eat-dog environment. (laughs) This quality is good for both the giver and the receiver, as well as for the benefit of the whole world using collective consciousness. Working with green quartz can promote cooperation and tactful honesty, and as such can be a wonderful addition to any home or office environment. You can give green quartz as a gift to anyone when selfishness and control are the forefront of someone's life and they need help to feel empathy and universal love for others. Number nine, orange calcite. Orange calcite can integrate the spiritual realm with the physical body, enhancing creativity and helping with emotional issues. You can use orange calcite to energize and cleanse the roots and sacral chakras and to bring positive energy into the areas of the will and sexuality. Meditating with orange calcite can bring insights into the cause of apathy or lethargy, allowing one to take back control over one's life. You can give orange calcite as a gift to anyone when there is a need for release of past traumas or letting go of the past when these traumas have been holding someone back. This will allow for optimism and joy to come into their lives. And last but not least, number 10, Selenite. This stone receives its name from the Greek goddess of the moon, Selene. Now don't confuse this stone with Selenite Desert Rose, because the Desert Rose has selenite throughout it, but is completely different stone. This selenite meaning from the Greek goddess of the moon is easy to see when it reflects light, often appearing as a rock fallen directly from the moon. Selenite healing properties are all about activation and reaching higher planes. It is known for connecting to the third eye, the crown, and etheric chakras. Through radiating light energy, it promotes purity and honesty, and it forces the person holding it to be honest with themselves, which is usually a very hard thing to do. By clearing energy blockages, selenite allows for a liquid-like energy fluidity. Selenite can align the chakras and raise awareness to a higher plane. Give selenite as a gift when someone wants to align and balance their seven chakras. All in all, when you receive a crystal or a gemstone as a Christmas gift this year, cherish it. Crystals are so healing. They are a gift that can be used over and over for years to come. Now one day, that crystal may remove itself from your presence. Just know that if this does happen, don't be upset. When we cannot find a favorite crystal, it does not mean it is lost. It just means that it has done its job with you 
and completed its mission in our own lives. Give thanks to the healing crystal's power that has been given to you throughout the years. Be happy. Send it off with love because your favorite crystal or gemstone has moved on to the next person that needs to heal in the same way you did. I hope you enjoyed this podcast or video, whichever you are watching or listening, should I say. (laughs) I am an avid believer in crystal healing energy. If you have any questions or would like to give some crystals as gifts, you can visit my web shop at www.stregaluna.net. That's stregaluna.net. You can find the link in the description below. And if you'd like to learn more about me or you'd like me to speak at your next event, go to www.lisamoria.com. All the links are in the description. I will be coming to you more and more every week because it is my goal to reunite human and nature by bringing you metaphysically, holistically, and spiritually awesome content. I will talk to you real soon. Namaste. I always referred to my life as a cross between Jerry Springer and Oprah Winfrey. Now, I refer to my life as the Creator's divine plan to enhance the life of others. I was always the bruise on the apple of my parents' eyes, getting in trouble running away, drinking and using drugs from a young adult up to the time I got pregnant with my son at 17 years old. After my son was born, I went right back to my old ways, almost losing my son in the crossfire. And that's just the beginning of my story. Maybe you have some struggles that you're going through, or maybe something from the past that you want to let go. Well, I have the perfect way that you can help yourself change your life for the better. I have online courses that range from spirituality to metaphysical to holistic online courses that can help you learn all the elements of spirituality and change your life for the better. You can visit www.counciloflight.net. That's www.counciloflight.net. Start changing your life now.